me saw Troy Troy gangsta Denver crib everywhere. Yeah, we in the tarp with it. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? This is where it went down at. This is where it goes down at. This is where it's gonna always go down at. Going to jail for a body at 18 years old. Hold on. Shout out Big my nigga MVP 30, 30 Ave, you know what I'm saying? Tap in with my nigga real MVP TV type shit, you know what I'm saying? East Denver, right 0205. 30 Ave. Man, let them know where the Oh yeah, you're in the corner. Where you at? We right next to the cage, you know, the cage right the there. Got a lot of history down here. We the 30s, you know what I'm saying? From 30, 33rd, Trey Deuce, OGs, rolling 30s, Trey 4, Trey nah, 5, Trey Fair. Lil BK Hella from Trey Trey Gangsta Crip. I'm already in the system, they know who I am. Stretchers. I ain't gonna lie, this shit was fun, Kaz, but. Like hey, who's on that bike? That's a regular old man. Y'all got me thinking it's nick in the nah, case. You know, I gotta get the, you know, I be having to get out the way like, do they thing. Nah, man, we on camera, man. You, you know, you we know. cameramen. <laughs> we <laughs> they we gentrified the hood a lot, yeah. So we, it, it, it used to be no white people down here at all. But when you come down here, this is the, the side of town that got the most black history, though. You know what I'm saying? The, I could take you to the five points. That is historic historical site. <clears throat> Back in the day, there were no white let come down here. They were scared to come down here. You know what I'm saying? This wasn't somewhere. This was supposed to be the most scariest part of town type. Niggas was not coming nah, down Nah, they here. still can't come down here. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> nah, well, I'm out here. We cool though. You feel me? White people cool. Just not where I live. Is it like racial tension out here in Colorado? Nah. Hell nah. Nah. We not racist. That's crazy. What's up with it? What's your name? Demaze. Demaze? Hell mm -hmm. yeah. Nice to meet you. Where you from, brother? San Francisco. You from Frisco? Hell yeah. Oh, oh, Hunters Points and all that type shit? Visitation Valley. Oh, Frisco, right. Frisco. Yeah. Visitation I'm, Valley. I'm from right oh, here. Cause he's Denver. Nigga, nice to meet you, huh? Nice to meet you. I like. He creeped up on me type shit. Let us know so. Yeah, we in the tarp with it. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, this is different. You know what I'm saying? This is where it went down at. This is where it goes down at. This is where it's going to always go down at. You want to know some history on this shit? They can't take it from us. That's right the only, here, that's the only the history. history. This right they here. They can't take it from us. Because they trying to it's take right it from here. us. They trying to gentrify it, but we ain't going to let them take it from us. Not at all. That's what I just said. Yeah. It's, it's, it, but it's beyond that, though. See, what's going on here is going on everywhere. Everywhere. And you know what's a testament to what's going on? Is us as a people not recognize what's going on and not moving accordingly. When we was young, we didn't know what we had our generation because early 80s, the gangs from LA came out here. When the gangs from LA came out here and the influence, it was more of a revolutionary thing because that just what was the energy of the people at that time. So just thinking like the late 70s, the 70s and the early 80s, it was still that power to the people, black. So, you know, when it came to the cripping and the blood and you know, that element of that was still here, especially when it was new. We was yelling roller 30 against the crib when we was I this fucking big out, out here, cuz this shit been going on. Our big homie, Philip Jeff Jefferson, bring it out here from the land and blessed us with the game and it took off from there, you know what I'm saying? You was around when it first happened? I wasn't around when it was first, when it first happened, but, but we got blessed with the game from Cali. We took it from there, you know what I'm saying? Like the east side where we at right now um, was predominantly black owned, five points downtown. It's owned by all black vendors, all black restaurants, all black bars. This whole neighborhood was owned by black people. Pretty much every city, you know what I'm saying? When black people started migrating to different cities and shit like that, east side is where everybody's at. Look, I mean, niggas talking about uh, niggas busy. me. Yeah, you gotta keep it real. And not fold on God. Yeah, I went to jail for a body at 18 years old, bro. On God, that shit get serious. You gotta figure that shit out. Is this what you wanna do or not? Nigga, on God. This, on God. But this is what niggas signed up for on Crip. This is what I was bred for. This was what I signed up for. I'm still out here. And I'm always gonna be out here forever. Yeah. On God. What do you think the parents that smoked crack did? They lost the house because they didn't know the business or they simply sold it. You know what I'm saying? So now we look up. And we got foreigners that's in our hood. It's on us, homie, but we still here because what make a neighborhood is you and your mentality. Because I'm I'm east side everywhere. I'm east side church right against the Denver Crip everywhere. I don't care where I go. Because my mentality is so cold, all I gotta do is get with like-minded individuals and then we can form Voltron anywhere. A G anywhere is a G everywhere. And we ain't leaving. We ain't going so nowhere. nowhere. See my, my it's a little different though, cause when I, I'm way, I'm only 28, so they way before you me. Change, type, the, you know change the culture. East when I was growing up, cause we was we was we was gang banging through sports and we didn't even know it. Our, I played for the East Side Disciples. You know what I'm saying? And our enemies was was. Our enemies. Hey, I'm about to gang. Cause I don't know about these just the sports.
Hey, all of that. But I'm saying it started from the start. I ain't gonna lie to you. It started. They teach all our all our fucking coaches was OG Cribs. Yeah. So it was like, and we was taught to hate. Across the boulevard. See, I don't know if you that. know, but all our, our enemies, cuz it's one street away, cuz right across Colorado Man. Boulevard, Park Hill. Man, and not even one street away, cuz in the same section, a right. couple blocks away. You Somebody know what was mean? telling me about Some that. Shit. It didn't wow me at all till the police came. Then in, in jail, you gotta stand on that in jail too. You ain't no burners in jail. You gotta learn how to fight. You didn't sign up for that. You, you, if you wanna go home, go be a civilian. Don't come to jail, bro. Don't do what you did to get here. So all out of towns. Don't get Denver fucked up thinking it's cowboys and horses and all that. Never, I ain't never been on a ski, mother. Never in my been life. on none of that. Fuck, I ski. Yeah. Ski, I fuck. Snow I ain't gonna ski. I be having fun. I love it. That I'm hood as fuck, but I be skiing. I be having fun. Now, like, it's beginning, it's like it's a little bit of everything. You know what I'm saying? Just like everywhere else. If not, just find out. The 8025. That's a fact. It get a little dangerous. You know what I'm saying? Anywhere. Because I feel like anywhere you go. I feel like just because it's just like Denver, y'all got kind of trapped in those middle states that people kind of like eh. But it's like it's a big. Man, you know what I mean? Check this out. You say you from San Francisco? Yeah, on my mama. I forgot about that. Came oh, out there. I mean, we ain't going to yeah, That was a long time ago. Oh, cuz I got scraped up by the old. <laughs> that was a long time ago. Got to talk of that too low. Cause he got yeah, his talk to the old. You go lie. Look, came out here, got his chain snatched. That's what I don't like. That's what we got to change. We know it ain't no f joke. I might have been a part of that. And I apologize. I'm changing. And as an OG, this is what you got to do to take those steps. But I want my city to be known for <laughs> the mother city that's like gold. You come to this mother. And black people is getting rich, and we own it. Look, he didn't been through everything we ain't been through yet. That's why he's talking like that. Cause I'm a crip, but the most important thing, you know what crip stand for? Community. The C stand for community. So you don't have no community if you don't have ownership of land. If you ain't controlling the money in your hood. If you don't got positive relations from the foe and the deuce and the tray and the whatever the fuck else. So where's the crip at? Where the C at? Where it at? I read. That's right. I read. Do y'all feel know, like because y'all from Colorado, y'all kind of got to prove y'all hey, shows a little bit more? Hell nah. Hell nah. No, I ain't got to prove did. myself to nobody. Hell nah. Yeah, we got niggas did, on the map. They see that. That's that. That's that East Side. East Side University. We don't got to prove ourselves for the fact. We don't never got to prove ourselves for the fact that the big homie brung it out here and blessed us with it, and then from out there came out here to with our gang banging, and we respect it in the land. You know what I'm saying? Like, came out here to see what it was really like. Other crip sets and shit. Like, back in the early 90s, they came out here with us on a, on a plateau. You know what I'm saying? They know about us. Our big homies went out there and was roaming the streets with them, too. And I like that how y'all say y'all stand on your own identity. Y'all ain't got to worry about other shit. Yeah. Cause, uh -huh. cause, so, cause, how cause look right here, cuz, on the game. Look, right here on the set. I got, I got jumped right here when I was young, cuz, when I was like 13. Got jumped right here, beat up. You know what I'm saying? Beat me up the homies though. The Crips walking with a full stamp car from my auntie house right here on the set. Cut, I'm right here. Cut humble. 30th of humble. Auntie right there. Walking right here. You it's it's hard. Gems right here. Like I said, this is legendary. This is a landmark right here. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. this, this where a lot of right here, you know what I'm saying? Because the box, you know what I'm saying? It's slept on. You know what I'm saying? Ain't no squares out here though. We don't really do squares out here. You know what I'm saying? Me? Not at all. Crips straight. But gems right here though, you know what I'm saying? This is where it's really get active at, right here. And this little really I ain't gonna lie, all through this. From Dollarado, from Dollarado Boulevard, from Dollarado Boulevard, cut all the way cat on the set. That's where it really get active act over it. The well, culture, our, our, our culture came from that was already, you know what I'm saying? It, it was meant, you know how some shit just meant to be? It was just already had to copy cat, do none of that shit like that. Yeah. Shit, you know what I mean? Niggas from over we here had to really, a little different too. Yeah, I'm right. A lot, a lot different than a lot of everything. Don't say a little bit. Yeah. A lot yeah. different than set. With us being the first Crip set in Colorado through these trays and all that, we built our shit on our own blocks, our own street, our own numbers, but we got shit here that represent California gang banging. You know yeah. what I'm saying? And I think that that's the biggest thing about us is we carved our mark with this gang banging on our own. You know what I'm saying? We was blessed with the gang, took our own streets, our own parks, our own landmarks, and did our thing. You know what I'm saying? I think that that's what's monumental about this territory right here with gang banging, with the black people, with the whole shit. It's always been us. Everybody's grandmama is grandmama to somebody. Right. Somebody's yeah, uncle is uncle. Yeah, Everybody knows somebody. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I stand on that. I really love that about the fact that I ain't claiming a California set. I can come to my hood. 
I could come to my block. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? And run that motherfucker too. And run it. Do what I need to do. You know what I'm saying? What I say, go on that shit. Just like in any other city. Niggas that, you know, chose to represent other niggas, but we represent all of us. You know what I'm saying? We that's what it is. You know what I'm saying? Denver East Side rolling. But this is play the game how it go. You know what I'm saying? But don't come out here thinking it's sweet though. Yeah. It's not sweet out here. You gotta think about it. No matter what we go section, division you ever go to, you always gonna have some goons. You always gonna have some killers. You always gonna have some hustlers. You always gonna have some you always gonna have some pussy. You always gonna have some rats. So it's pretty much the same everywhere. You got real and fake everywhere.